Hello, we're here to see the house. Uh, do you mind if I just like show you like, like, just, just, you know, what? Just, just give me the camera. G give me, the, give me the camera. I'll bring you in and like, you just, you just roll with that. Okay. Like, are you okay with that? No. Well, don't worry about it. I'm going. Let's go. I, let me show, let me, let me show you the house. Alright, so here's our house. It's a beautiful motherfucking place. Alright, so in the corner over here, we got this little piece of bread and everything. This is where Lydia goes so she can read her books so she don't have to fucking deal with my dumb ass when I'm doing dumb shit. You see up here, we have all our beautifully nicely hanged mushrooms, spices, some fish, some other shit too. That's how it works. Trust me, I would know I'm a professional. Professional, uh, buffet. You know what? Don't worry about it. She, she know. Anyways, Lydia's just sitting there chilling. Oh, here we have, you know, every place that we eat at and shit. Lydia's over here. You know, typically I'm the one who cooks. You know, you may be asking that because, you know, it's, it's two females and, you know, we, we'd be crazy. I'm the one who cooks, even though she makes a mean, mean stew. Anyways, like I said, over here we got all this. We got our little things. This is where, this is where we just keep all the alcohol. Up here, you see this giant one right here? This is literally for us on Thursday nights. We just take the whole goddamn thing and the one over here. We had a second one somewhere. Anyways, out of the two, we see who, see who can drink the most uh, without fucking, you know, passing out. And that, that's that's how we spend our nights. Anyways, now heading upstairs to where the magic happens. And by magic, I mean we fucking cuddle. So calm your ass down, get your mind out of the gutter. Out the bedroom right here. Beautiful, beautiful. Ain't nothing in this goddamn chest yet. We, we're, we're, you know, just still moving in. Renovating the place. We got some fucking candles and shit all over the place. This is where we wind down in the morning. And then over here, we have a child's room. This actually is more of my second room. Whenever I piss off Lydia, she wants me to like, you know, move out of the bedroom. Like I, I, I don't keep the bedroom. So I go over here and this is where I have to sleep. Even though this is the, you know, in just in case we get a child, which I mean, we th I've, I've thought about adopting one. Though so I'm thinking of turning this to an alchemy room. Though Lydia is saying we should adopt a child. I don't know where we're going with this, so anything's possible even though i think that yeah we have some wine in here right now because that, that lets you know that i've been in here anyways moving on from the fat that's our lovely 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 beautiful abode What, 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 huh, what, uh, 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 Lydia, I think I know where our next, our next journey is going to be. I'm sorry, I fell asleep there. I think I know where we're going to next. We're going to school. I'm an idiot. Hey, 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 you don't, you don't got to do me like that. Okay. I'm, we're going to the magic school. Okay. Mainly for me, but. Maybe you can learn some stuff too, you know? I haven't seen you even try to use some magic. Maybe, maybe you have a hidden talent out there. Um. Um. Uh. This was not supposed to happen. Oh! Um, I was just coming by. I was not expecting there to be a dragon anything why is there a dragon why the fuck is there a dragon why is there a dragon Yo, what have I done? Lydia, don't be talking shit to the dragon. What the hell? I just got here. You try to go to a place for some knowledge. Motherfucker said, nah. We fighting. We fighting. I got here and then a goddamn dragon wants to attack. Is this what you want, dragon? What the hell? 
Hey, chill, chill. Oh, snipe his ass. Flame. I saw that shit. I saw that shit, Lil Lilith. Keep it up. Take that lightning. What you gonna do, huh? Let my magic can come back. Come on. Hurry up, magic. Oh, you wanna land now. You wanna land. You don't know what you've done, boy. If I get over there in time. If I get over there in time. You have done messed yourself up. Alright, give me a sec. Magic. The conjuration. <laughs> Bound sword. Ow. You did it, didn't you, Lilith? Or you. Both of you guys did it. Thank you, guys. Uh, that was way more eventful than it was supposed to be. Uh, oh, oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. I forgot this happens. Ah. Uh, uh. Never get used to that feeling. Ah, oh, well, that's another dragon soul. Um... I can't just enter a town peacefully anymore. Dragons will attack. I didn't sign up for that in my contract by of, of me becoming the Dragonborn. The fuck? Okay. What are you about to do? The Imperators think us all lawless beasts. I'm proof of their ignorance. Okay, I thought you had to say something about the fucking dragon that just attacked us. No? Okay, making sure. You know, just, you know, I had, to, I had to ask. What do you need? Nobody, you guys don't have any, like, oh my god, you guys saw that dragon, right? <laughs> wow, that was crazy. No, just, <laughs> everybody's like, oh yeah, that happens all the time, don't worry about it. <laughs> time to go to the college. This, this was the original reason why we did that long ass journey, Lydia. Is to go to this college to learn more magic. I believe this is where the college is. I don't remember it at all. I think. Remember, we already did the first uh, the first step to getting into the college, Lydia, because we were we were a boss ass crazy motherfucker. Hello, sorry it took me so long. You know, you've been waiting for me for an extreme amount of time. How you doing, girl? Oh, what the? Don't be, don't be jumping down to an attack stance like that. I be thinking we about to get in a fight. You saw that, right? She tried to scare the shit out of me. It worked too, cause I was like, "What the? F huh? This, this a trial?" That's right, ain't it? I got trials to do. It's been a minute since I've been here. So what happened was, uh, I was visiting the town on a little break. Actually, I got lost. Me and Lydia got lost. Walked out here. You need to stop. And uh, we just randomly walked out here, found her. She asked us a little little test of us to do light magic. I did it, and now we're here. Are you just staying there? Or are you come with us. What's up? Winter holds glory days may lie behind it, but the college lives on. Uh, but, but what, what do I need to do uh, uh, again? You know, it's been a minute. You'll need to speak with Mirabel Irvine. Her quarters are in the Hall of Countenance, but she could be anywhere on the ground. All right. Who is Maribel? She's the master wizard here. Archmage Arryn may be in charge, but Mirabel runs the place. Gotcha. You do well to remember. Uh, okay, okay, don't have to do that to me. Is there an elven mage of the, the, the stars? Is there any advice you can give about destruction spells? I'm not a. I I actually am not into destruction spells at all. I'm my magic. I think is gonna be conjure. Though I like illusion and destruction as well. <laughs> uh, is there any elven mage here that studies stars? Why specifically stars? Wait, you aren't referring to... No, there's no way you would know about that. Would you believe I was given a vision? A vision? Well, I've certainly heard worse things. I think the man you want to talk to is Nelikar. He was exiled a few years ago. Bad research. Still hangs around the frozen hearth. Alright. Thanks, bud. Mirabel will be waiting for you. Alright, we'll do. That's the next thing. So let's go talk to Mel Mel 
Bach, I need to remember that name before I get kicked out. Uh, anyways, it's goddamn beautiful. So we're searching for Milik Milikar. Oh, she's here. I believe Mirabelle. I myself rather Boom. Clear. Yes. I don't want to interrupt, but I want to interrupt. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes. Don't want her to kick me out. I have manners, goddammit. Very good. Plus, I'm interested. Hey, Maribel! Welcome to the College. I was told to come see you. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are. Hey, left. magic. Well, first you'll need these. I would well, appreciate if you looked at me. Them. You may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. Uh, okay. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Let me look around real quick. Wonderful. Please follow me and don't yeah. wander it's off. Yeah, like I'd love to have a look. Let's let's look around. Winterhold has been a fixture. Also, real quick, uh, uh, what the fuck did you give me? Apparel? What the fuck did you? What? what, what, what uh. <clears throat> you think we do destruction out here, girl? <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Talking about, oh, this is gonna suit your liking a little bit better. It's more expensive than the one I wear, but uh, I think I use illusion just a bit. I'll keep it damn well. And I, I guess if we go in here and we're st we start doing destruction, it's gonna be really useful, but I like illusion a lot. Fuck it, we'll swap just, just for her little liking of us wearing different armor, okay? For thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. Okay. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above okay. that. Okay. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. Okay. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. You don't, sir. It's beautiful ass fucking flame. All right, let's go. To the right or to the left, or you, or you just don't like walking on your snow? Is, is that literally the situation, or is this some portal? Yep, you just don't like watching it, walking in your goddamn snow. And you're the boss, so I can't tell her that she's walking slow. Hurry up, Maribel! Oh my god, stop! Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. Okay. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Gotcha, so when I go in, immediately shout. Alright, I got you. I got you. That is my one skill. Being extremely obnoxious. No. <laughs> now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Okay. Now. Let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. KK? Oh, does this mean these are mine? Yeah. Come back for those later. Hey, Lydia. I don't know where you're going to be sleeping in all honesty. I'll probably leave, probably bring you back to the house or tell you to go back, you know, or you can stay here. One of the two. We'll figure out. We'll, 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 we'll figure out sleeping arrangements. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Okay. Hello. I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are not among them. Then why did th I didn't say anything? I said hello, and you just your okay, concerns. My concerns are not yours. 
Go on in. And if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Okay, okay. Inward we go. <laughs> Gotta be rude like that. Peaked. Are you sure you shouldn't be home in bed? Uh, are you saying that to me? Welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. Will do. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? Yes, point. You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should uh, do? Uh, oh, oh, God. See, I'm, I'm, I'm a listener, not a speaker. Uh, uh, uh... I think we should learn some practical. I'm I'm a, I'm gonna go with the practical approach. Is that so? See, she agrees with us too. Why don't you actually show us something? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. Okay. I'll teach you all a ward. And we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with a demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? I don't have any ward spells. That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward, one that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. You want me to over stand there, where? Please, just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Cast the ward spell. You have to keep your ward up or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. Try me. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Lydia, come here. I've got Wait here. I will remain on guard here. Thank you. Now, hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. I appreciate that. Short, fast, quick. We heading out? Yeah. Come on, girl. Follow it's me. Demand, Always. I talk to y'all real quick before we go. How you doing? New here too, eh? I'd hoped I wouldn't be the only Nord, but I should have known better. Why aren't there many Nords at the college? Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. Ah. No offense, of course. They're yeah, fine. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence. Or worse, it took years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. I'm meant to be the black sheep in the family. <laughs> what do you know about An An Ancano? I know he's from the Thalmor. That he claims to be here simply as an advisor. I also know that no one really believes that. I've been trying to avoid him, honestly. 
<laughs> yeah, we do, we already sort of learned the answer to that. Okay, okay. Hey yo. You are new, yes. Yes. Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? No. Not yet, but I will. Ah, this is good. Jizargo. But Jizargo will know them first. Oh. It is good to finally be around mages who may be able to keep up with Jizargo. Yes. You seem excited to be here. Oh yes. Jezargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully small things that fit inside boxes <laughs> and will not be noticed if they are missing. <laughs> Straight to the point, are we? Why'd you become a uh, student at the college? Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod and the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gisargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics. Dedicated to study, this is the place for Gisargo to become great. Alright. See ya, Gisargo. Mm -hmm. Understand, I'm gonna need to check my pockets when I'm with him, though. Another new apprentice, I see. Yeah, hey. Are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely. Was it you? What? What, what is it you do here? I'd like to know more about the. Ah, uh, let's ask that. Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the. More about that more. We seek Sorry. only to help Skyrim, to guide its people through this time of transition, to help lead them to a better future. What is it you do here? I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. Ah. I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Does the Archmage often ask for advice? Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. All right. Peace out. Lydia, you following, right? Yeah, come on. Let's go. Hey, yo. You look a bit peaked. You sure you shouldn't be home in bed? You are relatively new here, are you? Just because I'm a dark elf, you, but we have not I'm gonna have problems. No, we haven't. Then allow me to introduce. Wait, myself. you're a dark elf too? What I you mean? <laughs> Arin, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. Oh. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Ah. Are we clear? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, what did I do? Don't act as if I had some. <laughs> I'd like to know more about the college history. I've seen documents dating back to the late Second Era. It ignores yeah, question, ask question back. Events in the last several hundred years resulted in a significant... And don't should be a problem, right? <laughs> so, uh, yeah, about the history here, right? <laughs> uh, what's the purpose of the college? Purpose? I should think it's self-evident. Magic is a true power, not something to be shunned by commoners or treated as an amusing diversion by politicians. It shapes worlds, creates and destroys life. It deserves proper respect and study. The college is a place where we can focus on that, without the pressures of the world weighing down on Smart. us. Smart. Dangerous research must be a problem here. Not often, no. Some risks must be taken, to be sure. I am simply trying to avoid untimely deaths. Ah, tests. understandable. We also must make an effort to avoid worsening what Skyrim thinks of Good us. point. Uh, what happened in the last few hundred years? The Great Collapse, as it has come to be known. An unfortunate natural disaster that ravaged the area. The college fared far better than the city of Winterhold, but it was not left untouched. What caused the Great Collapse? No one is sure of the cause. Some believe the eruption of Red Mountain had far-reaching consequences that were only felt years later. I know there are some who have blamed the college, said that we were responsible. I assure you this is not the case. Tell me more. The sea of ghosts practically came alive. No one was expecting it. Monstrous waves battered the shore for weeks on end. 
Winterhold was ancient and weathered, but it couldn't withstand the sea's fury. Entire districts of the city were lost overnight. The waves receded in time, but the damage was irreversible. Most residents of Winterhold abandoned what was left of the city. The college survived, Ooh. and so here we remain. Huh, okay. Uh, Next time, Archmage. All right, we can go to bed for a bit or go straight to the next area that they were talking about going to.